Moxley. All right, Will Uta versus John Moxley. Break. He loves this. This is his element to stay on. Oh, will you come and fight back? Okay. The fight and the vigor is coming at a Will Uta. You not backing down. Knee lift by Moxley. Uta hangs on to that bottom rope. Comes back. Moxley sent to the outside. Wheeler Uta. Took a second to catch his bearings. What is this young man gonna do? What is Yuta gonna do? Yuta up to the top. And Moxley, Moxley through the table. Wow. Wow. Great job right there. And this may be the turn of events that Wheeler Yuta needed to get back into this match. Test. That height right there. You're right, X Cal, the hard impact. This definitely possibly could turn things around for Yuta. But again, that blood is pouring out of that wound. Very graphic, very tough. You see it just literally pouring out of that open wound, which I would assume is an eight or nine stitch, maybe ten stitch situation. And you know William Regal and Brian Danielson watching this match very, very closely. Moxley doing the smart thing, returns to the ring as Yuta is still struggling. There's Doc Samson next to Albert, keeping an eye closely yeah. on how Wheel is doing here. Yeah, making sure that laceration isn't open wide enough to start approaching the eye. Do permanent long-term damage, but Yuta beats the count, but you see Moxley. Moxley even for breath, Taz. He sure is. He's got all of Yuta's blood all over his body. Oh, uh-oh. Backslide. One, one two. two. And you notice you'd have got up on the tippy toes. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh. Oh, for a German, maybe. Deadlift. Oh, nice. Well done. He kept his grip, locked his fingers. Swing arrow, I'm still going, man. Nice yeah, man. Lock. Rolling over, looking for the triple German suplex. Shows how much Locks I care for it. Now, show that. Brutal elbows. I love you. Oh, rolling elbows. Oh, nice. Moxley hits the ropes. Went for that King Kong lariat. You to block that. Okay. That was phenomenal. That was excellent by Will Uta. Really. Man, oh man, this kid is rolling right now. Oh wait, Uta. Uh oh, gripping the ankle, er, gripping the wrist of Moxley, and now kicking his head in. Kick his head in like Danielson. We saw Danielson do this earlier. It's it's Paige right now. Danielson's book. He's done. He's done that to Uta a bunch. And Uta heading up top. He likes that flying splash. Oh, we got him. One, two. Oh, monster kiss out. I love the tenacity. Stay look at this. Oh, cross face. Man, will Moxley tap here? Yuta with the right arm of Moxley captured. And notice the technique by Yuta. He's covering the eyes of John Moxley so Moxley can't make it to the ropes. And now he's shift, shifting his grip a tad. Oh, Moxley breaks free. Hooked in. No. Great idea by Mox. It didn't work, but great job. Oh, King Ooh. Kong Lariat. Uh-oh. One, two, no. Wow. You get that okay? Holy cow. This is a battle in our main event on Rampage. Look at the amount of blood loss by on Yuta's head and face. And Yuta just blinking those eyes, trying to get the blood out. And John Moxley, you can imagine the trash he is oh, talking to him. Oh, he's talking to a bunch of trash. Tell him, hey, man, you are not going to survive this. That's probably what he's telling him. As you get into the guy's head psychologically, while he's bleeding like a stuffed pig. Whoa. But Yuta responding to all that trash talk, responding to this beating. Oh, but Moxley. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's hard to watch. Bite. He got the cut. He's biting the open wound. Moxley, he looks, looks like he just... And Moxley, oh. when he returned to okay. action earlier this year, he said he drinks blood. Look at this. But Yuta... But look at the traces of Yuta's fingertips on Moxley's spine. Turn about fair play. Yuta... Oh, Caught him, paradigm shift, game over. Ooh. One, two... Oh, my God! Holy how do you kick out of that? How do you kick out of a paradigm shift from the top rope? That's a holy shit moment, dude. And this guy is getting so over. Wheeler Yuta. Wow. Kicking out of the paradigm oh. shift. Bulldog choke. Bulldog choke. Moxley in the bulldog. Center of the ring. Wheeler Yuta with nowhere to go. Can he survive this? Can he weather this storm? Gotta be lightheaded. Let's cap all that blood. 
Don't tap, don't tap, don't tap. Knee strikes to the head. No, we we'll, one, two, two. Oh, nice. He's out, he's out. He's out. Win matches, dude. This this young man, you just showed so much heart, you gotta beat his heart out of his body. And John Moxley, the regal knee. Paradigm shift. Game over. Oh my god, dude. Oh, he's got the weird choke. It's over. That was a great match. What a match. What a match, man. Honestly, bro, this is probably one of the one of the best. I know we don't remember much of these Rampage main events, but it's probably one of the best Rampage main events televised of this year, man, in my honest opinion. But yeah. Wow. Willie Uta, man. Starting to make it. Starting to make it. I'll tell you that. I'll tell you that. He he'll be he'll be carrying the company in the next. He has zero. No, there's no, no I tell you that he'll be carrying this company in the next ten years when Kenny can't do it no more and Audience here saying, shake his hand. I guess out of respect, obviously. Wow. Wow. The ultimate gesture of respect for Wheeler Yuta. Will Yuta shake that? Well, I guess he will. There you go. Nice. William Regal extending the hand. Well, he obviously learned, earned the respect of William Regal, Danielson, and Mox. What an incredible seven days for Wheeler Yuta. And just a yeah, what an incredible seven days for this man. Incredible two weeks, a couple weeks for this man. This, I'm telling you, man, this guy's gonna be carrying your company when Kenny, when Kenny can't do it no more, when. Mosley can't do it. Damn Sue can't do it no more. Um, when guys like Joe, Punk. How how old is Willie Utah? How old is he? Let me pull him up. Willie Utah, how old is he? Uh let's see. Okay, the internet is telling me he is twenty. 25 years old. This guy is only 25 years old. Future of pro wrestling, man. This guy's going to be, I'm telling you, man, once Kenny's gone, Moxley, Danielson, Jericho, you name them. Hey, man, once they can't do it no more, guys like Lee Moriarty and 
Daniel Garcia, Will Yuta, they'll be carrying this company. Well, this company is set up for the future. This company is set up for the future. And I love it. This is what I love about pro wrestling. Stars being created and the future is set for 10, 15, for the next 10, 15 years. You know, the future of pro wrestling today it's going to go crazy in the next 10 to 15 years. You got guys like ASF, Antonio San Francisco. Got a lot of potential. I've seen the guy work. You don't know who he is? Go look him up. I'll tell you now, man. This guy has the potential to be your next. The guy's the next Rey Mysterio, in my honest opinion. Oh, well, there'll be another, there won't be another Rey Mysterio, but this guy looks like he has the second making of Rey Mysterio. Uh, you got Nick Wayne. I heard a lot of good things about Nick Wayne. I believe Nick Wayne is only 16 years old. Nick Wayne, 16. Anakin Rosen. Thunder Rosa's son. The, 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 the son of Thunder Rosa. Only, I believe he's 16. Yeah, 16 years old. He's got to be the future. His mother is going to give 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 this son that those talents. I'm telling you, man. Telling you. Um, who else? Roxy, only 20 years old. Willow, Willow Nightingale. Those are gonna be your faces of women's pro wrestling. When Shasha's gone, when Becky, when Bailey, when Charlotte, when who else? You know, Deanna's already is already at the top. When these women can't do it no more, Willow's gonna be taking over, Roxy's gonna be taking over, Corey Jay's gonna be taking over. The kid line's gonna be taken over. Miranda Alize is gonna be taken over. These people will be taken over in the next 10 to 15 years when the guys that we see right now that are really getting up there when they can't do it no more. The future's set up, man. It's set up for good. Other than WWE, because they like to build stars, but I I hope they get they get their ass up and start building stars pretty soon. Like ASAP. Because what do you, who are you going to turn to when Randy can't do it no more? Your part-timers can't do it anymore. Brock doesn't want to come back. Romy can't do it no more. He doesn't want to come back. He wants to go to Hollywood. Same thing with the horse women, etc. Who are you going to depend on? Carmelo Hayes is the future. Braun Breaker. Grayson Waller. Tony D'Angelo. Those guys will be made of in WrestleMania in the next 10 to 15 years. I guarantee you that. But anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, thank you guys for watching. It is 2.12 in the morning, and I'm just done filming. Um, I highly appreciate y'all. appreciate the support. I want to thank y'all very much for supporting me. It's been a busy, busy week, work week. Outside my job, I mean, outside my YouTube, I've been working. Working, working, working. And Saturday is my only legitimate off day. No YouTube work, no out, no outside YouTube work. So yeah, man. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I highly appreciate y'all. Please like, please comment, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys Monday for a brand new week of brand new week of content for Monday Night Raw, man. I love y'all. Take care. I'm out.